Hi Leo, this is Carrie from Celestial Forecasts with your five plus minute mini five cast. So let's get into the messages. I'll be pulling from these three decks here. Everything will be listed down below. All right, so starting with the Grande Amore deck by Maria of La Bella number 13. Let's see what the advice is here for you. For Leo. All right, so we are starting off with Shattered separation and heartache game over so this could be an indication here that somebody really hurt you big time a broken heart because you guys are not together right now either you decided to end things with somebody or they ended it with you let's grab another one from here love lessons karmic connection now this could have been a connection with a karmic partner or certainly a lesson to be learned through this experience Let's grab a couple cards from the Pink Divine Love Oracle by Jennifer Aquarius Tarot. All right, we've got sugarcoat, superficial expressions, not all that it was cracked up to be. And maybe you really invested your time and energy in this person. Look at the next card. We've got rose-colored glasses, see past the illusions and unkept promises. Wow. So this is coming through as a very challenging situation and life really turned itself around on you to where you needed to break free from this connection look at the next card guys we've got free yourself burdens stress and negativity be gone so this might have actually been one of those situations where you were better off without this person all right i'm pulling from my valentine connection tarot deck here you're better off without them leo and maybe, you know, when you guys were together and you were crazy in love with this person, totally into them, maybe it was just very difficult for you to see just how bad it actually was, you know. We do have the King of Swords. This King of Swords card was wanting to come up in the reverse, so that's how I'm going to have to read that. King of Swords in the reverse is somebody who can be very callous, okay? They're not tapped into their emotions, and so they could have been very cold towards you however through these lessons leo look at this you've got the sun coming through so through learning lessons through detaching from people that no longer even deserve to be a part of your life this is you being able to dedicate time and energy towards somebody who is but first you got to dedicate part of that energy to yourself get yourself out of situations where somebody just hasn't treated you right if you're looking for a commitment in a partnership you will eventually find it. It's just not this person. And love lessons and spiritual lessons are coming through here. And this is so interesting. We've got the moon now, which is, again, tapped into illusions. We've got rose-colored glasses. See past these illusions because they were keeping things from you. And what they were keeping from you could have been other people. So yeah, it's time for you to get out of this situation because you deserve better. And here it is. It's on its way to you. But first, you got to take action and get out of this one. Sorry about that, guys. Camera glitching once again. It's unbelievable. We'll get this straightened out eventually. So as I was saying, you need to be able to detach from this person because there's someone way better suited for you. And you will eventually find happiness. But, you know, take a break from this connection. Focus on self-healing. Focus on what you can manifest in your life by detaching and freeing yourself from people that really bring you down you know and it's time to make yourself a priority they could have been juggling they could have been keeping things from you as we've already seen you know the juggling thing could be between you and somebody else you're meant for better times ahead with somebody else here you know because this could be giving you the opportunity for a new beginning certainly when it comes to love it's a very positive vibe there you could also end up meeting somebody new through your circle of friendships because the three of cups is about your community, your friendships, your tribe, your soul tribe, your family, people that make you happy. So spend time with those individuals rather than somebody who has hurt you in this way.